while we're doing top secret, get your you should go over to adafruit.it slash Discord. Discord. It's free to sign up. Yeah. Join the other almost fourteen thousand people and yeah, post go, your questions there. Go there and start getting ready to ask your questions. So first up, uh, what's this? Coming soon. SCM 32s people love them. I don't really know them. I'm I'm hopefully ambivalent, but we um, are trying to do more STM32 projects. We're we're exploring beyond just the Atmel chips and microchips that we've been using uh, to the high-powered STM32 chips in existence. So this is the STM32 F12 Discovery Board. These Discovery Boards are so cheap, and they're nice. They have all the stuff on them, and we're pointing Circuit Python to it. So even if you look in the S3 buckets that for our CircuitPython builds, you can download CircuitPython for the STM32 F412. We get digital I.O. working, I2C working, and I think we have analog inputs working. So Speaking of, but surely. we have an STM board coming out. We do, and I even have it physically here. So this Really? Is, well, it's not built up. It's just the, the prototype. But this is the STM32 F405, which um, is the same chip used on the Pi board. And it is a nice chip. This is 168 megahertz, uh, 64 pin QFP, um, got plenty of peripherals, analog inputs, two DACs, which I like. I love the double DACs. Uh, I put USB-C on it, QSPY. I put a Stemma connector actually over here, a, a Stemma QT quick connector. So you can, um, so these boards that uh, people like, you can then, uh, you can see the connector here is the same one here. So you'll be able to plug easily I squared C devices into it. Same battery backup stuff. And then on the bottom, um, connected to the SDIO pins, I've got um, a uh, micro SD card. And somebody was like, oh, could you put in a you know SWD connector? There wasn't enough space on the top. You see, it's just packed. But on the bottom, if you're willing to do it, you can solder it on uh, SWD on the bottom, and then it you know won't sit flat, but you'll be able to want a debugger on it. That's yep. coming soon. Uh, hopefully this will come up. I don't know. I've never done a layout for an STM32 board before. This is my first one. But I, you know, it, didn't, it made a lot of sense to me what's going on. And then we posted it on um, the blog, and people had some great suggestions. I caught a couple bugs. I caught a couple bugs. Uh, I think uh, it should be good. Yep. Excited by this. But it has to go back in the vault. Sorry. Back in the vault with you. Okay, well, like we said, um, we answered questions. I loaded up.